Hey, what's up my YouTube friends? This is the new Odin Wolf machete. Let me give you a closer look at this beast. It has a tube lanyard hole. It's got some texture on that handle. D2 tool steel, jimping. And this is a fierce blade, definitely. I'm most likely going to take this out into the woods and put it through its paces, but that'll be when the weather gets better around here. For right now, I figured I'd have some fun with this on the bottles. It came with this sheath. Oh, I don't know if you can hear those mosquitoes buzzing. So you see how that is, the slats and eyelets. It's a molded sheath. Nice. Yeah, Odin Wolf is definitely a brand that I like. Here is their uh, sow catcher. It's their pig sticker. I'm sorry for any background noise. This is their double-edged sow catcher. All right, so I have all the wolves of Odin. Uh, so these are all pretty awesome. Piercing, slicing, chopping, throwing. All right, similar blade lengths, but this has a lot more weight and also the handle, right? That handle gives you a lot of leverage, whether you want to choke down or whether you want it more as a counterbalance. All right, you see the texture on the handle, tube lanyard hole. Yeah, Odin Wolf, definitely uh, one of my favorite brands, definitely an up and coming brand, I would say. I mean, <laughs> that says it all, look at that. Anyway, I figured before I take this out and torture test it, that I would uh, have a little fun with the bottles. Uh, I will include a link, so if you want the full stats on this, you can click on the listing below the video. All right, we got Odin Wolf Machete. This has some serious weight to it. It's a dual grind. That won't be a problem. There you go. And the bugs are waking up. It's the early morning here. All right, let's try the other way. Stay low. There you go. Cheers to you. Hope you're all doing well these days. This thing hits like a wrecking ball, let me tell you, because of the weight. Okay, a very sharp wrecking ball that slices That was more of a slice on purpose. Now, sorry if the lighting is messed up. It's before dawn, and also we have a huge amount of fog coming in, but that actually might be more like ash from the fires. Okay? Cheers to you. Until the nukes fly. There's a lot of ways to cut a bottle. You can chop it straight on, or you can more slice it, or a combination of both. There you go. Okay, let's try two. How about that? Great success. There you go. Now this is heavy, it needs extra. I had to put in a little extra to accelerate it to the proper speed to do the static cut. Okay. Three, can we do three? Can we do three? We did it! Great success! I wasn't sure there for a second, but there you go. You know, one thing I learned in life, you're never going to get tested at the thing you're good at. You're never going to get tested at the thing you're good at. It's going to be things you're bad at, right? You know. When I die, I'm not going to be at the gates, and they're going to say, if you can cut static cut three bottles, we're going to let you into heaven. I'm not going to say that, right? All right, so if you like cool stuff like this, be sure to subscribe. 
All right, people, one more bottle. That's all the bottles we have. Nice clean cut. So I hope you enjoyed this. Odin Wolf is a brand that has actually impressed me quite a bit. I have many of their, many of their blades now. I do recommend them. I will take this out into the woods and torture test it, but I just figured before that, might as well show you, uh, you know, what the factory edge can do in terms of having fun. It's a fine tool for many purposes. If you want to pick one up, support the channel. Links will be included in the description. Be sure to subscribe if you like cool stuff like this.